TK, how good is it after a tough couple of matches and a busy few weeks in London to be here in Cardiff and have a full test build-up week? Yeah, it's great. You know, last week we had the, the four-day turnaround and we only really trained once properly um, the, day, the day before the game. So it's, uh, it's great to get into Cardiff early and have, you know, that sort of seven-day seven, uh, preparation before, before we uh, play. Obviously, uh, World Cup fever struck last night with the Wales England game. What did you the guys make of that? It was plenty of noise about. Yeah, I think you probably could have tell who was scoring just by the, the noise of them downstairs in the uh, in the bar there. But um, obviously, it's um, you know it's a great result for for the Welsh and and, and being here in uh, in Cardiff. You know, I don't think I got to sleep till about twelve o'clock last night. I could hear I could hear cheering till the early hours of the morning. So. Um, as you can see, it's pretty quiet around here. At the moment, I think uh, people are still catching a couple of Zs. Mate, what is the key things for you guys to raise the bar this week on, and you know, get in a solid performance? I, I think we can um, put put a lot of emphasis on our um, on, on the breakdown, on our clean out work. Uh, you know, getting getting past the ball. I felt as a nine last week that uh, I was having to go in to get it instead of just having it there for me. So, um, you know. Georgia are um, massively physical uh, side, and uh, you know they obviously got the win over over Tonga there. So um, we're definitely not not taking anyone lightly in this competition. It, as it's already shown, you know that the gap between um, the so-called second tier nations is closed considerably um, in four years since the last World Cup. So we're really looking forward to the match. We know it's going to be a real tough one. After a pretty um, tough, tough year coming back from injury, how good was it to get out there and how you, how you feeling like you're progressing? Yeah, I was trying to keep the smile off my face the whole week, even when we were uh, walking out there onto the paddock for the national anthem. Everyone had serious faces on. I was so excited I couldn't stop, stop smiling. But um, yeah, it's it's been a hell of a year. Um, I've obviously taken a lot of learnings from it, and I, I think I've grown as a person as well. Um, but just to get back on the paddock in that black jersey felt like the first time again um, so I really loved it and hopefully I get another opportunity sometime in this tournament. Perfect mate, have a good week. Thank you.